Live from the Big Beefy Man Cave in New Bedford, Massachusetts. This is the YouTube channel vlog show in which video games, flash game show gameplays, along with sports and wrestling news, are the norm. This is the YouTube channel vlog show of positivity, good times, and fun. This is Eric Lima Shenanigans of 1977. And now, here is the host of the show, the perpetrator of these shenanigans, Big Beefy E himself, Mr. Eric M. Lima. Thank you very much, Mr. Announcer. Well, hello there. Welcome to uh, yet another episode of Eric Lima Shenanigans of 1977, episode 126 of the show. What's going on, everybody? Hope you guys are having a wonderful, blessed day. As you know, um, on the last episode, we talked about what happened on the last Monday Night Raw of October on Halloween and uh, the last Monday Night Raw before Crown Jewel. As we know, we got Friday Night Smackdown to deal with. When it comes to that, NXT tonight, it was a celebra um, couple of matches um, happening. Uh, Grayson Waller goes one-on-one -on -one with R-Truth. And Mandy Rose, one-year celebration of being the NXT Women's Champion. Who is going to challenge challenge the, the leader of Toxic Attraction for that title? Who knows what will happen. But until then, until then, it's November 1st. That's right. That means the month of Thanksgiving, Survivor Series coming around the corner. And not only that... Um, as you know, some very important uh, details and dates. November 5th is Crown Jewel this coming uh, Saturday. Um, also, um, um, uh, also, uh, also, the 11th is when November 11th, not only Veterans Day, also is when the Atari 50th Anniversary Collection for all plat gaming platforms coming out. Including Nintendo Switch, what I bought, I pre-ordered for the uh, Steel Book Edition. Can't wait to get it. And originally, I was gonna plan. Uh, yeah, I forgot I was planning on playing something in the Atari 50th Anniversary, but then Godfather Dom, aka Dominic Williams, requested I play Mortal Kombat 11. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm deciding to move <clears> that. I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make a couple of changes. Uh, I just realized this. So um, the changes I'm going to make. All right. So I'm going to have a little bit of fun. Because I want November to be a fun. It's the holidays. To me, November kicks off the holiday season. Right now, we're trying to work on Thanksgiving. But also, people are getting Christmas stuff ready uh, already, man. Let me tell you, it's going to be a lot of fun. So, but for right now, we're going to have some fun. Play some high rolls and Trebek Tuesdays, as you know. Eliminate the nine numbers up there and then win ten grand. All right, so we're going to do it right now. We're going to go and, okay, we got a six. Remember, doubles are good, too. Doubles are the best rolls because they can help you out. Just like that, double fours with an eight. The six and eight is gone. All right, six again. We're going to go five and one. So I want to make sure the one's been eliminated. The eight is... Nope, let's go. All right, got a nine to eliminate. All right, very good. So can't roll an eight yet. All right, let's go. Nine. Okay, need a seven to win. Oh, nope. All right. That's okay. It's all right. All right, and here we go. We've got a six to work with here. We're going to... Up. Snake Eyes. Two is gone already, so technically a two is not a bad roll because it's a double. Doubles are good. Bear that in mind. Doubles are always good. Even if you roll a bad number. See? Like that one. Got a nine to work with here. All right, one, four, five, and eight. Let's get rid of the eight if we can. No. Rolling those seven. All right. All right, here we go. We got an eight to get rid of. There you go. Let's see what I roll. Ooh, double. Double eight. Double four is an eight. You can't double eight. It's a 16. Got a five to eliminate so far. Two, three, four, six, and nine. All rolls are good here, so six and two. All right. All right, let's see if we can roll a seven or a 12. Nope. Oh, jeez, nope. Wow. Look. Double five is a 10, so nine and one eliminate. So two through eight are still in the game. Two consecutive doubles. That could be very, very helpful. Nine. Uh, seven and two. All right. Three, five, six, eight, nine, eleven. Let's roll on those numbers. Nope. Nope. Ah. Oh. Wasted. Wasted. Wasted the insurance. The insurance marker. Okay. Got a six to work with here. Got a nine to work with. Six and a nine. Please no jokes on those two numbers. Please. Thank you very much. Eight and three. So far, so good. One, two, four, five, six. Okay, double fours, one and seven. 
two, four, five, six, seven, nine, eleven. Let's roll one. All right. Well, two and a five is seven. All right. I need a four. Double twos. Nope. I need a four. No. All right. All right. Here we go. I'm going to find a work with here. Yeah, eliminate the five. Double fours. Thank you. Eliminate the eight. Nine. Right next door to the eight. Go to sleep. Seven. All right. Let's go. Six. Ooh, a ten would be nice. All right, half that. So, got a couple options here. Get back to back fives on this. No, we need another five. No, okay. All right, haven't got a win yet. Haven't got a win yet. So, we're working that way. We're working in the process here. Let's trust the process. Six and four have been eliminated. Nine and a two. Oh, good news. That was a double. A ten. Seven and three. Obviously. Five, six, eight, and nine. Six. Give me a double or an eight. No. By one. Well, we're halfway through the ten minute mark. Oh, halfway up there. Uh, a four, double, double twos. You got a five. We're going to eliminate the five. A ten, nine, and a one. Here we go. Four's been... Oh. Two insurance markers. Double fours. Eight. All right. Got the six to eliminate. Ooh, boxcars. Can we get boxcars? Okay, nine is good. All right. Got a chance to roll a three. Let's see if we can get... Nope, that's three times. Nope, one more. Ooh, two sevens in a row. All right. All right, let's roll the numbers. Got double threes. Very good. Let's see if we can get those going to five. All right, the five and the six are gone. Another six this time. Um, four and a two, obviously. Two, five, and six. Don't roll those numbers. A nine. A nine. All right, three, four, eight, seven, eight, nine. Three and four, seven through 12. Okay, that's very good. Eight and one is nine. All right, yo, Sean Spears, give me a ten. Yes! All right! Yes! Yo, Sean Spears came through again. All right, here we go. I'm not in the mood to sing that stupid song. I promise you, sometimes no silliness for, for a while on this. I don't want to be too silly. All right, six has been eliminated. So is the seven. Six again, five and a one. All right, still good numbers, all of them. Eight. Eight and ten. Don't roll those numbers. Three. Two, four, six, nine, eleven. No, that doesn't work at all. All right, if I don't we'll do another win by the ten-minute mark, I'll end it that way. Oh, very good. Six and two. All right, nine and one is ten. So eight, ten. There we go. All right, three, four, five, seven, and eight. We can need to eliminate the four. All right, three, five, seven, eight, ten, tw eleven, tw and twelve. No, that's not it. No, that's not it either. All right, folks, here we go. Step right up. Got a nine here for you. A seven here for you. Oh, double fours. All right, one through six. Still in, still in the biz there. All right, two and eleven. Don't roll those numbers. A seven, three, and a four. All right, I need a six. No, I need a six. Oh, no, that's a double. I need a six. Yes, sir! All right, we did it again. All right. Here we go. Very good, Eric. Very good, me. Very good. I'm having some fun here. That's the most important thing. I'm having some fun. Just being chill and having fun. Being chill. Okay, okay. Seven and nine are eliminated. Got a nine again. Going to go eight and one, all right? So at least two through six to deal with. Oh, double threes. Okay, two through five. Let's see, five, four, nine, nine, and five. Okay. A ten. Uh, two and a three and a five is ten. All right, need a four. El Cuatro. Nope, that's half that. No, as a double. No, by one. Let's see if we can do it again. Oh, missed by one. One more time. All right, looks like it's going to be the last time regardless. 
I would love to get three wins, but you know what? I tried. Uh, I cut that rule out not too long ago. So and I just did because I, you know, I was very, very quick. And that's the thing. And I was very quick with the, with the with the dice roll. Sometimes. Okay, six and a two. Two six and eleven. Oh, okay. A lot of numbers are left up there. So that's it. That's all the time for the uh, first portion of the of Trebek Tuesday number eight. And that would be that. So, episode 126. Um, this is the first part. Um, up next, um, a little ad uh, promoting both with some of the sofas. I got you know four good, good um, four young gentlemen, good good friends of the, um, good friends of the show. Um, are uh, promoted. In fact, there was no both us last night because of the Halloween special. So they will get that moved into next week. It will start off. Uh, Kick off the November season, so it'd be November seventh. So a little promo for both of us and the sofas. Until then, I'll I'll come back here for the twenty five thousand dollar portion of the show. So ta ta for now. Do you have the Monday blues? Well, there are four gentlemen that will help you cure those Monday blues every Monday afternoon. Join Garrison Newkirk, aka Mister Garrison A Six. Along with his sidekicks, Jerome Latimer, a.k.a. Romy2184, Alex Putnam, a.k.a. Apizzle90, and Austin Putnam, a.k.a. Austin Putnam. For both of us on the sofas, every Monday afternoon at 5 p.m. on the Mr. Garrison 96 channel, only on YouTube. Hey, back again for the $25,000 edition of the Big Numbers. You know, I know the drill. Um, like I said, both of the sofas will make their return this coming Monday, November the 7th. Check them out, 5 o'clock, on the Mr. Garrison 96 channel. What what uh, what um, what shenanigans are they up to? Even though I am the master of the perpetrator of the shenanigans here on my channel. But they have their own different kind of shenanigans over there. Check them out if you can. And uh, let's see what, um, what, they, what craziness and madness they'll dish up. You know, like I said, Garrison Newkirk, Jerome Latimer, and the Putnam Brothers, Alex and Austin, they'll come up with ideas. They'll come up with movies, music, and everything else. And they kind of inspired me to bring back um, a list. I usually do top 10, top 5, top 10, top 15 lists and all that, and all of my personal favorites. I'm, Like I said, I'm bringing them back for top of the shenanigan charts. I'm still working on a lot of that because I know a lot of people are out there... Uh, a lot of people out there, they kind of judge me of the of the company that I keep as far as friends are concerned. They, a lot of people have judged me about that, unfortunately. But my idea is to invite everybody into my channel so they get to know me beyond, oh, beyond, oh, you're part of Rant and Rave, you're this person's friend, you're that person's friend. So I always encourage people to come on this channel and subscribe. And that's why I'm bringing back the top... That's why I'm bringing back the list, the top list, my personal top favorites. The top of the shenanigan charge has been called... And I'm more than just a guy who likes game shows, um, wrestling, and video games, okay? Just to let you know. There's more to me than me CI, folks. I'm like a Transformer, you know, because I like other things, too. And I'm trying to work on the list of that. And hopefully um, hopefully I can get those lists to you. So I'm still working on a lot of lists. Sometimes you, you jot them down and you, you figure, you know, because you want to get lists ready. And that's very, very important. So I'm working on that. So let's get back to the twenty-five thousand dollars edition of High Rollers. You know how this works. Eliminate the nine numbers and win twenty-five thousand. And we're gonna go and get going right now. So we got a six. Here we go. Seven. Seven's gone. Seven again. Uh, five and two. Or oh, three and four. Two and six have been eliminated. Five again. Let's go four and one. All right. Three, eight, nine, eleven, twelve. Let's we'll see if we can roll those numbers. Or oh, three is good. All right, we're down to eight and nine. Eight and nine. Oh, I rolled a six. I'll tell you what. You think the two of the highest numbers would be easy to roll up? Remember, doubles are important. They can help me out. Okay, five and the eight. Five and the eight. Here we go. A four. Let's go. Seven. A five. Um, three and a two. That's the only thing I can think of. All right, give me the doubles. Give me that's one double. All right, a seven, six, and a one. Perfect. All right. All right, give, give me a nine. Nope, that's a double. 
Oh, by one. That was close. I was hoping for another double. Alright. Let's go. Okay, got nine. I got ten. So, nine and one have to go. Obviously, I can go eight and two as well. And I can't go eight and two now because I eliminate 88. Two through seven. Six is a cutoff. Alright. So Eleven. Uh, seven and four. Alright, need another ten. Nope, I got a four instead. I just eliminated a four. Okay, got an eight to work with here. Let's get some doubles. Seven. Alright. Let's go. You know it would be a challenge trying to trying to win this bonus round without getting doubles. Easier said than done. So far, one through five. Got a double, double fives. Hmm. Let's go five, four, and one. Need a, need a five now. Like the Big E in King Kong Bundy number five. Oh, what am I doing? Five. Oh, good news is, okay, subtract so two from that. I need a three. Oh, I got, oh, I got two insurance markers. Give me a three. Nope, it's 11. That's been eliminated. Nope, three times that. No, I need a three. Oh, by two. All right, no problem. Still have yet to win. Still have yet to win. Three to one is four. Got to eliminate the four. All right, ten again. Go nine and one. That goes to four. Double fours. Five. All right, seven and three is ten. Let's get an eight. By one. Missed it. Got a nine to work with. Got a six to work with here. Six and nine. Please, no jokes in that number. Okay. Got a five. There you go. Seven. There you go. An eight. There you go. All right. Three. Ooh, a ten. Give me a ten. A seven will do. Four, two, and one. Give me a three. Close. Very close. Very, very close. Very close, very close, very close. Seven is gone. Nine is out the window again. Very good. Double fives. Eight and two. All right, one, three through six. All right, 11, six, and a five. Eight. Four and a one is five. Three has always been the lowest numbers have been toughest to roll. Nope, that's 11. No, three times too much. It's like a game of math. You know, if you like, the kids watch game shows when they were little and, you know, like, hey, this is good learning math. Nine and two is 11, you know? Probably, probably the reason why I think we're super smart because we watch game shows. And game shows are very educational sometimes. Seven and one. Uh, the old box cars. Five and four is nine. Here we go with a three again. <clears throat> yeah, I'm kind of curious how we, you know, how we get sometimes get. You know, we're smart with stat, uh, statistics of things that we like, but when it comes to real life, sometimes we ain't the brightest bulbs, but whatever. You know? That's how I am sometimes. Oh, four and two is six, though. All right. Back to back eights would be nice. No. <clears throat> Man. This is good. This is going to be We're treading on rough waters here. Got a nine to work with here. Got a six. Oh boy, what a day. Three and a one. Seven. Got a seven. Got a nine. Got an eight. Got five. All right, come on. Six. Ooh, a ten again will be nice. Ooh, uh-oh. Mm-mm. 
Uh, this is not gonna. Uh oh. Mm, can't roll a one unless your name's Chuck Norris. That's a good. That's a good Chuck Norris fad. Chuck Ro- Norris can roll a run, run or Chuck Norris can roll a one with two dice. There we go. That's a four, seven. Double threes. We got a five. Five, six, and seven are gone. Nine go. Bye, bye. Let me see. One, two, three, four, and eight is seven again. Um, eleven. Nope. Let's go. Ooh. Let's go. Come on, eleven. Oh, jeez. Come on, eleven. Oh, crap. I don't know what's up, man. This is a new month. Let's go. Dude. Nine and one is ten, even though it's a double five. Gone. Six, uh, four and two. All right, come on. Nope. Five, yes. All right, the old tie, the old Sean Spears. No. Yes, uh, the double saved me. All right. Got one. Got one. Got one. Got the going to win. All right. All right. Very, very good. Well done. All right. Let's see if I can do it. One more roll. Looks like one more gameplay. I said at least get one win. I'd be happy with that. It's been a tough road to get there. Okay. Seven and four. Let's go. Uh, two and a three. Give me a six. Ooh, by one, and that will be it, and that will be all the time we have. Episode 126, um, the $25,000 portion of of Trebek Tuesday, and um, November the 1st. So, congratulations. So, we're in November. And this will be the first NXT of November tonight. As, uh, like I said, our troop goes one-on-one with Grayson Waller, who will be Braun Breaker's next challenger after conquering... A challenge, turning back the challenges of Ilya Dragunov and J.D. McDonough. And Mandy Rose celebrating one year of becoming women's champion. We'll see what the ladies of Top Second Attraction up their sleeve. We still love Gigi Dolan. So, shout out to her because she's got great curves. Anyways, will, will uh, Zoe Stark and Nikita Lyons go, still go after the women's tag team championship? We'll find out there too. And I love Nikita Lyons because she also has nice curves. Anyways, <laughs> might I digress. So, that is it and all the time we have on the show. I will see you guys later. You guys have a wonderful and lovely day. On Until the next episode comes around, Mr. Announcer, please take us home. That is all for today's episode. This is Mr. Lima speaking for Eric Lima Shenanigans of 1977. A big beefy E, do it for Bob Saget Production. And in association with... A sweet, bumbling bofo raver telepictures and distribution. See you next episode, and have a very blessed day.